Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls. And this is our daily card reading for April 16th, 2022. AngelSoulsFullFullFour.com for personal readings. And of course I have my events happening on Bright. All that information is down below. I have my first chapter of my book Matronia up over at Substack if you want to go check that out. And of course joining Patreon for a dollar a month, you get extra content and the personal readings, all the things, all the things. And a happy birthday to my niece, Alicia. Okay, so let's see what we have for today. That was a lot, <laughs> a lot of things, a lot of involvements. Okay, <laughs> Epiphany, Archangel Raziel. So Raziel is the magician angel. He's all about taking something and you know, think alchemy, yes? Taking something and letting it be pressured into, <laughs> letting it be pressured into something else, that, uh, into something else. That's what I just define alchemy as. It's fine. Taking one thing and turning it into another. But there is a number nine at the top of this card. Now that is spiritual lesson completion. Okay. So there's an epiphany. There's something, and this goes along with the weekly. So if you haven't checked out the weekly yet, do that. Joy through spiritual growth. Be a light to others. Answers that come through meditation. This is the energy that's trying to get you prepped. So something may not happen exactly today, but something rattles us. It gets us to go, oh, <laughs> wait, what? And it might even be like a spiritual epiphany or it might be a secret gets revealed. Although I don't think too much surprises us when a politician gets exposed or, um, you know, business people get exposed for their behaviors and what have you. But there's something that comes of that. There's something that really pops your mind and your heart open. And it makes you realize, no, this is not how the world can be anymore. Now, I'm not talking about people who get on their high horse and they get their agendas and they think that, you know, a lot of people will go after agendas because of control. They want to have power over other people. I want to manipulate you. I want to make you believe the way I do. And I'm not going to have any respect for how you see things. And I'm going to control what you say. I'm going to take away everything. Cancel culture, right? I'm going to ruin your life because you said something I didn't like. Or I have a right to hurt you. Some people might think this. I have a right to hurt you because you said words. You said words I didn't like. I'm not going to respect you as a person, uh, but you need to respect me. <laughs> so there's a whole lot of that going on. And I think there's going to be quite a bit of topsy-turvy turnabout where people, it's going to get messy first, but something happens and people are just not taking it anymore. And if you're one of the self-righteous people who thinks that you're always on the side of right, I think you're in for a huge awakening. So we'll leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.